What's happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Castle Soul awaits. Let's go get the medallion. Hopefully, uh... Hopefully, we also pick up a, uh... Did that reach that far? Oh my god, it will. Die, lion. Wonder, will this castle have a legendary weapon in addition to the part of the seal that I need? So we got the seal. We got two divine towers to do. We have this, whatever is uncovered over there. Um let's see something. There could be a third underground region, I don't know. It's very possible that there's a whole underground region connected to the sewer. But yeah, so right now the focus is I want to get this thing. I want to unlock the secret passage of the lift. Oh, you know what it is probably? Where's, where's Dectus? That probably leads us over there when we lower it. But so I want to see what that, that region's like. I also need to do my Divine Towers. I've been sleeping on those for a bit. Um, and I see no reason to let them sit forever, because, like, we are, uh, you know, we're cruising and bruising through the game right now. I also need to decide what my plan is going to be regarding leveling. And um, honestly, I think I'm just going to keep leveling. And part of me was like, oh, you know, I should... I think, I think the last episode I mentioned it briefly, but I was... Because looking at my stats, like I have... I already have... This, this is a full-on character build. Yeah, 45 vigor. It's a lot of vigor. Mind up at 24, plenty of FP for casting, endurance at 31, more than enough stamina. 22 strength, 23 dex, like low-key quality. Uh, and then faith pumped all the way up to 51. Like, so this is not like, you know, this is a build. This is like, if I was going to make a build video, these are the, the type of stats I would have. And, you know, on one hand, I'm like, I should stop leveling, we're good. Like, I don't, I don't need any more. But on the other... I'm like, I'm not done the content of the game. Why would I, you know, why would I stop leveling? Why would I stop getting stronger when there is still stuff to progress? At the end of the day, I don't really care that much about, like, oh, I leveled too high for the PvP meta, because with the type of weapons I'm using, this is a PvE build that I'd like to do some PvP with, but, I mean, it'll be so long. You know, the majority of PvP is definitely going to be on uh, other characters, because this guy, you know, 
at launch, how many other people are going to be level 120 already anyway? And all that way around, you got a painting. Mm. Oh! Oh, wow! Cool! So just drop down there, work my way around. Dope. I was about to say, I was like, alright, where else do we go? Nope, I already did it. Uh, that looks... Let's see where this leads, and then we'll go that way. Why don't you come up the stairs, buddy? The sword is just getting stronger. As I gain strength, so too does my blade. It has fallen countless enemies of mine. I was going to drop down here later, but since we fell, might as well take a sneak peek at what awaits us. faster to go around this way. I think that tower is going to lead me through to like a boss where the top is. Maybe they both are. I was also debating on getting the mausoleum, but given how I have two mausoleums already that bugged, um, I'm going to I'm gonna hold off until I have all the remembrances just in case there is a, a double that I want. You know, like, maybe the boss has a shield that I really like, but also has a crazy spell that I need to try because, you know, I'm a spell dude. But we'll hold off. Which is slightly annoying because you just hear, DONG! Just perpetually donging away. I'm like, ugh. You don't stop the donging, do you? You're just gonna keep donging. My ding ding dong. Grace in here. It's definitely a Grace in there. Wicked son of soul, surrender yourself to the eclipse. Grant life to the soulless bones. Clips Shodel. Death Flare, Curved Sword, EDD. Set the lusterless sun ablaze with the Prince of Death's Flames, inflicting the death ailment upon foes. Holy shit. Follow up with an additional input to bring down the armament, triggering an explosion. Uh, do I have a rune in effect? I always gotta check whether it's uh, follow up with like a heavy attack or follow up with an additional input.
This is super strong, dude. Let's take it around. I'm gonna die. He's throwing stuff at me. Terrifying. I mean, that's our boy, that's Oleg. Oleg, duh, he has no chill, we know this. Phantom version of Oleg is fucking terrifying. Oh, I wasn't sure what that was at first. I was like, oh, it's just some, some dude, I'll kill it. And like this, I can test out my stuff on this guy, fine, it won't matter. And then, uh... Pretty much as soon as I said that, I saw him draw out the double claymores, and I was like, and it's time to switch back to our real sword. Playtime's over. Fighting a big boy. this lead. Yeah, it's official. This is my, uh, I think this is my new all-time favorite weapon art in any Souls game ever. This is really, really hard to beat for me. This may be my new all-time favorite Souls weapon. This thing is amazing. I mean, fantastic moveset with the great sword. Uh, fast enough that you're, you know, you're not like dragging ass to try and swing it, but still with enough oomph that it can poise break. You get health as you begin killing enemies. It has split damage. Which, while one could argue split damage is, you know, less than ideal because you would get more with a pure damage weapon and buffing it. At the same time, it's it's you know, it's ease of use. It's just, yeah, this thing has two damage types. It's nice. I don't need to, you know, no, I don't, I don't got to constantly put fire on my sword. My sword just has fire. Uh, massive, massive weapon art that has a huge range. So much so that it, it you know, at this point, it, uh, I would go as far as to say that it outclasses some of the spells that I have. Well, actually, no, it outclasses a lot of the spells that I have. Um... Some of these fights, I think it's even outclassing Flame of Frenzy. It's just... This is a very, very potent, very strong weapon. I work my way back up top, because I, I, I went after Oleg, and that kind of got me turned around a little bit. I was going through here. Yeah, I was like going through... No, did I do that? Yeah, I did the drop down. Is that where I went? Was it the ladder? That might have been it. Let's see. I even have my stones on. I gotta start throwing these bad boys down when I go places. I 
hadn't been through here. Is this where I went? No, because there's loot over here. This is the elevator. Looks like it just brings you right up to here. Bro, come on. I mean, I'm all about it, but like that sword, are you kidding me? We were like here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nine. The sword went like almost twenty paces. Like that's huge. That's such a stupid range. I love it, but like, it's not. It's not fair. It's not fair at all. Okay, so that goes up top to whatever is up there. Do that in a little bit. I think otherwise we're done. Done. We've killed two different, two different uh, special banished knights. One with a halberd, and then your boy Oleg. I still didn't go inside this place yet. No, yeah, I did. Hang on. Where did where did this go from here? I went there. I try. I never mind. I see now. I went there. I got the death scythe, and then I did not go through here. I went through there, and that's I took started taking ladders up. I think, and that's how I found Oleg. Yeah. Because there was an item there and the thing broke, and I recognize that. Okay. Um. Uh, one, eight, and five. Because right now, my greatsword is, like, my main source of healing. Is me popping that. wants to feel the burn of my blade. Son. Oh wow, there's a second. Did I have a sign to bring a friend with me there? Church of the Eclipse. So, I'm gonna go to that elevator real fast. 
I'm thinking because every castle we've been to so far has had a legendary armament. And so I'm thinking maybe one route, like maybe the elevator takes me up to the fight for the legendary armament. And maybe uh, following the path takes me up to the second half of the medallion, or vice versa. Or this is just a shortcut that we get later. do some spell updates. I haven't... Uh, like you, good AoE. Cheap AoE. Are we only three AoE spells, though? I mean, this is my... This is a boss nuke. This is a wide range. That can be a decent roll catch, though, because of the variable timing. You're garbage. You are quick to throw out. Pretty good. I like Frost Breath... Let me go Rot Breath, let me go Frost Breath. And then how about... This is Affinity for Damage Negation. I think Golden Vow. And Blessings. Physical and fire affinity attack. Wait. Fire affinity attack power? Bro, flame grant me strength might be crazy. Pence, can I stack these? I need to I need to get somewhere I can can't see my buffs right now. Uh, sword, picture, and armor. Nine twenty. Wow. Over two thousand damage on it now. Jesus. Seven sixty seven. Yeah, that's a huge, huge buff. are testing my patience. Oh, the boss is right there. Oh, the shortcut's right there. Bruh. Ah. Ah. Just gotta run and hit the shortcut. So, the question, though, let me see. Um, so, 667. Seven sixty-seven. That twenty-one. They do stack. They do stack. That's absolutely insane. What about this? Eleven oh five. What the fuck? <laughs> what? What, bro?
So the jellyfish and flame grant me strength do not last long. Mimic, I'm coming. Prothes prothes yeah. prothesis 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 I can't pronounce it I'm weird storm kick DD 1512 bladed prosthetic I can say prosthetic prosthesis yeah bladed prosthetic leg and power of lightning instead attached to the fist Commander Nial, veteran of Castle Soul, offered his prothesis in exchange for the lives of defeated knights held prisoner. He went on to lead these men as an army of no nation. He thrust the prosthetic leg into the ground, creating a storm. Follow up with a strong attack to perform a lightning infused jumping attack. Uh, I wanted to try that out, and I wanted to try out that. Oh, I had the dex thing on this whole time. All right, uh... Not really liking that. I do that, and then follow up with a heavy attack to slam it. I mean, it would be really hard to have somebody that's gonna sit still long enough that you can do that, but... It, it would definitely fuck people up, given the fact that it's, uh, less death build up. I'd be curious how fast it builds up, though. No, stop that. Spend your souls. Oh, uh, where do we want to go? Faith is helping me the most. Strength ain't doing it. That ain't doing it. Gotta be faith, man. Another boss? I'm just going to the top to get a chest. Hallow Grease, Treacrit, Medallion, Half. Lord McKella, forgive me. 
The sun has not been swallowed. Our prayers were locking. Your camera has been soulless. I will never set my eyes upon it now. Your divine hallowed tree. Oh, you may not, but I sure as shit will. So, no legendary armament, just that. Uh, so let's let's wrap here. We got Castle Soul is done. I could do the mountaintops, but instead we are going to go to the Grand Lift and find out what happens when we have this. <laughs>